Ever since I started working at The Gardener, I've wanted to find out more about this painting because I think it's one of the most beautiful works of art in the museum. Fra Angelico painted this in 1434 for one of the most important churches in Florence. At the time, it was the home to the Pope, and this painting would have been brought out of it probably only for one day a year. And that's the Festival of the Assumption of the Virgin. It's the 15th of August. It's the same date as the Fisherman's Feast. I'm not a native Bostonian. I didn't know about the festivals in the North End. When I was talking to Mike and he told me that he was involved in this festival called the Fisherman's Feast, I was fascinated because this was exactly the same kinds of pageantry and ritual that took place around our painting in the 1430s in Florence. All members of the Maritime Society have roots in Shaka, Sicily. The whole society is based on the Madonna. The founding members were fishermen, so they just continued more tradition of blessing the fleet and processing the Madonna. You know, it is all about the Madonna and, and celebrating her and family. Both the painting and the sculpture are made with paint and wood and gold. They're both objects of power that have the ability to generate crowds. And the importance of both objects transcends the materials from which they're made. What gave this painting even more power than its image of Mary were the holy relics contained within its original frame. It doesn't exist anymore, but the original frame of this painting, like the one you see here, contained fragments of saints' bodies. For example, pieces of fingernail, strands of hair, and fragments of bone. And that's why people came out to these processions, because this image, like the sculpture in the North End, was believed to have access to the sacred. It generated a celebration and a parade of the kind that you see today for sports events. You could see in the North End the civic importance of the statue. I noticed that the procession was stopping along the way at buildings marked with small blue reeds. Mike later explained to me that these marked the homes of recently deceased members of the society. They come and they, they pay respects to them. They put the uh, wreath on the saint mm -hmm. and we put money on it. Will they stop here every year to pray? They stop here every, every, every year. year. Yeah, every year. The parade culminates in this incredible flight of an angel above the crowds, reenacting the kind of activity believed to accompany the Virgin's ascent into heaven. I'm Ava Marie Bonavita and I'm a flying angel this year. I've been practicing for about two months. You have to look right at her and say the speech because in the English of the Italian, it's like a prayer to her, so you're saying it to her. I had no idea that there was such a great connection between past and present in Boston, and I'm so grateful to Mike for really showing me 